weird. What I'm trying to say is I'm here to give you guys my Royal Rumble 2021 predictions. Let's do it. First up, the women's tag team titles. On the line, champions Asuka and Charlotte Flair. Woo! Taking on challengers and former champions Nia Jax and Shayna Baszler. I feel like Asuka and Charlotte, there is a storyline if they lose those belts, but I feel like it's too soon. They haven't had the belts that long. Shayna, Nia had them for quite a while, so in this match on Sunday, I'm sticking with the champs, the queens of tomorrow, Asuka, Charlotte Flair, retaining. Next, the WWE World Heavyweight Championship of the World. It is three McIntyre against Oldberg, William, Bill, Goldberg. This match has got a lot of people scared. A lot of people think Goldberg could win this match. He's never held the WWE title. He's been Universal title. He's been World Heavyweight Champion, but he's never been WWE Champion. But I've got to go with Drew McIntyre. I mean, Braun Strowman beat Goldberg. Drew McIntyre, he's above Braun Strowman. You have to give the win to Drew. If Goldberg beats Drew, it's going to be like The Fiend all over again. <coughs> Fans are going to go crazy. Twitter is going to melt down and it's not going to be good. So it has to be Drew. If it's not Drew... Speechless. Next, a last man standing match for the Universal title. It is the Tribal Chief. Ooh! Roman Reigns taking on Kevin Owens. Now, we all know Kevin Owens is crazy. He will do anything to win. Just look at WrestleMania last year when he jumped off the sign onto Seth Rollins. That was insane. So, last man standing match. This thing could get very brutal. And the Tribal Chief is no stranger to brutality. But I believe Roman Reigns gonna retain. I mean, we're coming up to WrestleMania. You need your biggest stars in the biggest matches. And no offense to Kevin Owens, but Roman Reigns is the man, is the star, is the Tribal Chief. And he is gonna be holding that belt going in to WrestleMania. Now we get on to the women's Royal Rumble match. So, some of the favourites currently are Bianca Belair, Bailey, Alexa Bliss, you've got Rhea Ripley, people talking about her, and you've even got Ronda Rousey, some rumours. I think if Ronda returns, she is a lock to win. You cannot have Ronda Rousey return and not win this match. I believe that Bianca Belair is currently the favourite to win. But I feel like it's too soon for Bianca Belair. She's only been on the main roster less than a year. And I know she's got the documentary, she's got the momentum. But like I said, it's a little bit too soon. I mean, she wins the Rumble, she wins the title. What's next? It's too fast. You know, give her more time to develop give her more time to be on the screen. So I am going to go with Bailey to win. She's won everything else, but she's never won the Royal Rumble. So I believe Bailey is the safe choice to win the Royal Rumble, go on to WrestleMania and probably challenge Sasha because we've had a year of building to Bailey and Sasha, we need more matches between those two. And I think WrestleMania is the place to do it. And finally, the men's 30-man Royal Rumble match. I love this year's Royal Rumble because it is so unpredictable. You know, the years when we knew Shinsuke was going to win, kind of boring. But this year, it is wide open. So, some of the favourites, AJ Styles. Keith Lee, Daniel Bryan, Edge. We've got outsiders like Big E and Sheamus. And then Brock Lesnar, 
John Cena, Seth Rollins, The Fiend. The list goes on and on and on. But who do I think is gonna win the 2021 Men's Royal Rumble match? That's why you guys are here, because you wanna hear my thoughts. And I am thinking, I've done a lot of thinking, and I am gonna say, Daniel Bryan. He is currently the favorite to win. And I'm gonna say Daniel Bryan wins and goes on to face Roman Reigns at WrestleMania. I think if Brock returns, he can get eliminated and maybe Keith Lee eliminates Brock Lesnar. There's a match right there. Maybe Edge versus AJ. There's a storyline, there's a match right there. Uh, Sheamus, Big E, their, their IC title, don't worry about them. Um, John Cena, all those other people, you cannot have everybody return. You can't have Brock, Cena, Seth, Fiend, CM Punk. They can't all return in this match. It, it would be too many returns in one match. It's, it's not gonna happen. But I think Daniel Bryan deserves to win. I think he will win. And the Yes Movement will go on to WrestleMania and I don't know if he's going to beat Roman, but you never know. WrestleMania, it is time to make WrestleMania moments and maybe that would be a huge moment with fans finally coming back. So those are my predictions. Let me know what do you think in the comments below. Let me know your predictions. Hit the like button, hit subscribe. Join me on Sunday for my Royal Rumble hype party and I'll go more in depth on my predictions, more in depth with you guys giving me your thoughts live on Sunday. So hopefully I'll see you there. Hopefully everybody enjoys the Royal Rumble and who's gonna win? I'm not confident in my picks, but this year is totally up in the air. So we'll have to wait and see. All right guys, thanks for watching. I'll see you all on the next one.